Hey Dark Ops Technicians, welcome back to Mortal TV, and you ever wondered how a single key can make a little bit of a difference in your customs games? Well, today we're going to spotlight the dorm room 203 key. Is this just another inventory filler, or could this actually have some use? Go ahead and hit subscribe as we go and find out the truth behind this key. This key can fit in your pockets in a little 1x1 one one grid. The dorm room 203 key is just another key, just like all the others, very small, weighs 0.01 kilograms. Imagine scavenging through the jackets, rummaging through drawers, or even rifling through the scavs' pockets or even their backpacks, which are the most usual spots to loot for this key. Now there's a bit of a twist with the normal looting for this key. You can actually find this at a static spawn. It's going to lie in a red mug. The mug is going to be located in three-story dorms on the second floor. You can go in through the side here that's next to the car extract. Just go up the first stairs and it's going to be right here on your right. 214. The four is kind of falling off, but that's it. You're gonna need a key to get inside here, and obviously it's the dorm room 214 key. But if you have this key, you can go on and go inside. And there's a red mug. Inside this red mug, the dorm room 203 key can spawn in. I didn't get it here, but it can spawn in here. Now, assuming that you have the key, you're gonna to wanna to head over to the three story dorms and off on the side, the stairs where you can get up to the third floor and still be able to get in. On the south side opposite of where the car extract is, you wanna go up those stairs up to the second floor going inside. And that's gonna be like your fastest route to get in. You can still go through the main entrance and go up the stairs on the inside. But once inside, you're gonna go down two doors on the right and that's gonna be it. It's the first one that's barbed up with all the wires. And it also has a three missing from the sign, so it's just 20, but it's really 203. Now let's find out what's behind this door. Is it worth it? Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Once you hear the lock click, you'll be able to go inside. Inside, you'll find two sports bags that can spawn in. So personally, I don't think it's worth it. 20,000. I mean, you, the amount of time it takes to get to dorms. If you survive this room specifically, not too worth it. Though this room combined with all the other small ones, it actually would be in my opinion. And they all have 40 uses, so they all will pay off. I mean, it's not total waste. It's all about opening up new opportunities, I guess, when looting. But if you just want high value loot, not this key. Now, honestly, the most interesting thing about this key isn't the room itself. It's just that it's used in a quest. It plays a crucial part in shaking up Teller quest that you get from Prapper. For that quest, you just have to turn in this key. You don't have to use it or go inside the room itself. You just have the key, you turn it in, you call it a daily done day. Have you ever used the dorm room 203 key? If you did, go on and let us know in the comments down below. What unexpected riches did you get from here? And just in general experiences, you use it to kill someone, confuse someone, hide, I don't know. Gonna drop it down in the comments below. Let's share our Tarkov tales. So is the dorm room 203 key worth its current value, pricing around 19,500? In my opinion, no, it's not. But that's up to you to decide. If you found this deep dive helpful, go ahead and give us a like. And consider subscribing for more Tarkov guides, secrets, key guides, this and that. Helps me make some more videos for you guys. Remember, an escape from Tarkov, knowledge is power. More than any other game out there, really. What you know, you can use way more. Call of Duty, and you just shoot the guy, respawn, you know. Here, you can't really depend on respawning. It'll get set far back behind. But anyways, like the video, give it a like. See you next time. See you later. Bye-bye.